What up, fam? It's your boy, G. Ridge. Today, I'm going to cook some Southern-style neck bones. Yes, sir. These are going in the oven at 375 degrees. These are the ingredients I'm going to use. Chicken broth, white distilled vinegar, not apple cider vinegar, white distilled vinegar, chopped onions, and I got some of that tropical saison, some black pepper, and some brown gravy. Okay? We got some kosher salt. We also have some minced garlic okay we have some bam mama there goes that man some some oxtail seasoning from ultra reels is straight fire okay we're keeping it moving all right so fam i got 10 pounds of regular fresh neck bones also have some chicken broth less no sodium and water okay there's the um the birth on fleek right there with a little tiny little bit of vegetable oil in it. We got some potatoes, carrots, some onions, and some red bell peppers. I think the red bell peppers taste good with this. We're going to, as you can see, we got the oven ready at 375 degrees. You ready? I'm ready. So hold on tight. I'll be right back. All right, you got your 10 pounds of neck bones. You're going to start with a one and a half tablespoons of kosher salt. All right, followed by one half a cup of the brown gravy. Okay, you know, make sure you're going to pour it on there real good, mix it all around. But don't forget, we're going to mix it up together. Y'all know how I do it. Okay, that's followed by one tablespoon of black pepper. Mm mm. So a lot of good seasoning going up in this thing, fam. All right, two tablespoons of chopped onion. Two tablespoons of chopped onion. Mm -mm. We're talking about some flavor up in this thing and the season absolutely perfect. All right. One tablespoon of the tropical Saison seasoning. That's the tropical kind. Okay, fam. Followed by, last but not least, one fourth of a cup of the Ocho Rios oxtail season. Stick with your boy. Mm -mm. When, I take, when that, the flavor and the smell come out this kitchen, fam, ooh we. All right, we're getting ready to mix it up. All right, first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead in the oil pan. We're gonna put some some of the onions and bell peppers in the bottom, all right? And it's gonna be followed by one tablespoon, okay? One tablespoon of the distilled white vinegar, okay? And, follow, and also behind that, we're gonna add one tablespoon of some minced garlic, okay? We're gonna let it cook a little bit, you know, brown a little bit, and then we're gonna turn the stove off. And that's when we're gonna add three cups of water. Three cups of water. Mm-hmm. We're not gonna, we're gonna save the three cups of broth for last. So we got uh, six cups of fluid, okay? Okay, so now that we got everything mixed up real good, we're gonna go ahead and put the neck bones in. Okay, one at a time. Spread them out, pack them and stack them. Yes, yeah, sir. Then we're gonna follow by the potatoes, the carrots, and then the onions and the rest of the bell peppers, okay? This is gonna be a definitely a thing of beauty. Then we're gonna end it with pouring in the three cups of the less sodium chicken broth. Put a lid on it. Okay, and we're gonna go from there.
Okay, fam. So we're gonna cook. We're gonna cook it like this. Yes, it is ready to go in the oven. 375 degrees. Two hours with the lid on it. Okay. Then after two hours, you're gonna take the lid off for another additional 45 minutes. Okay. Also, you want to remember that every 30 minutes you're gonna check it periodically. Take a spoon and, and, and dip some dip it in the juice and pour it on top of the neck bones. Okay. 375 for two hours then after the, the two hours you're going to take the top off of it okay and then you're going to um cook it another additional 45 minutes to an hour without the lid on it so it can brown real good stick with your boy so hold on tight i'll be right back and bam mama there goes that man look at that goodness fam Ooh, we let's go and try a little piece for y'all. A couple of pieces. It's coming off the bone, just the way you like it. If you like this recipe, follow it to a T. Y'all already know what to do, man. I hope y'all have a blessed Sunday out there and a blessed rest of the week. Ooh, we look at the integrity of everything. That's how you want it. I cooked it on 375 for three hours. It took three hours, two hours, okay, two hours uh, covered, and then one hours uncovered. Stick with your boy. It's been real, fam. I love y'all to life. G Rich out. It's another one. In your mind. Bye, fam. You can put this over some rice, better noodles, uh, mashed potatoes, whatever you like, or eat it just like that. Stick with your boy. Love y'all.